Oh, my favorite is Phil. Who's is it? Who is the best? Who is the best? One of the most intimate scenes in the Bible is the scene of the Last Supper. Jesus is with his band of followers. And it's the night before he goes to be crucified. This is our last meal together. Before I die. What do you mean? I'm going to be betrayed to my enemies. Arrested. And condemned to death. Don't be afraid. Trust in God. Trust in me also. You know the way to where I'm going. We don't know where you're going. How can we know the way? I am the way. The truth. And the life. This, this is my body. This is my blood. Remember me by doing this. I'm going to the Father, but I will always be with you. I've been wondering what it would be like if I was sitting at the table. And as Jesus explained as he broke the bread and shared the cup of wine, what, as I perhaps would begin to understand just a little bit of what that meant he was going to have to leave, that he was going to have to die, and things would change. And, and I think of all the struggles in my mind that I would be going through. But here, as it were, he was, even in these last hours, giving us something in this gift of this remembrance of him, this bread and this wine. And now for 2,000 years, the church has been reminded of all God's love for us in what he did for us and how he sacrificed himself for us. And so even in his final hours, as it were, he's thinking about us, of how we could remember him. We thank you, Lord, by whose word everything comes to be. Amen. Amen. On February 28, 2014, the church has been given a wonderful gift. It's a gift that will help us explain our Christian faith. On that date, the movie, The Son of God, will be released. And it's my hope and prayer that weekend that theaters would be packed out of those who are followers of Jesus and those that aren't. And, but in order for that to happen, we within the church need to help. We need to do something. We need to take specific action. We need to let people know that this movie is coming so we can Facebook about it, we can tweet about it. But perhaps you're a business person and you want to make a, an investment in this, an investment in changing people's lives. You can buy an entire theater so that people can go and see it. Perhaps your congregation as a pastor, you can, you can fill out a theater. Perhaps you're a small group, a Bible study group. Maybe your whole Bible study group could go together but we need to take action because we want to 
everyone on that Monday, following Monday morning, talking about this film, The Son of God. But for that to become a reality, we within the church have to take action. How did this happen? What are we going to do? Change the world. He will bring a new age of righteousness and justice. His power will draw all men to a new world. All people!